this video in any way helpful, please like and share. So first in the troubleshooting method is we're going to test your hardware. Dells have built in diagnostic software. You hit your power button and start tapping on F12 to access it because this could be a hardware or a software problem. So we're going to test for both. Okay, so now select diagnostics and let it start testing your components. Okay, and you're going to select yes. Now, if you find your hard drive or RAM fail, you're going to need to replace those because uh, that could be the cause of your problem. For example, you can see my battery is close to dying and it just warned me about it. Uh, we have a video down below in the description on how to replace your hard drive if you find that's the cause of your problem. Okay, so as you can see, my uh, all my components passed. So the next thing I'm going to need to try is go from a software standpoint. I'm going to need to hit power. And I'm gonna, once the Dell screen starts, I'm going to hold down shift and then I'm going to hit my power button until it completely turns off because right now we're going to access another feature of your Dell, your recovery manager. Okay, once my computer is still off, I'm holding down shift still as you can see, I hit the power button again. We're going to access that recovery manager because we've addressed the hardware issue and it doesn't seem to be the problem unless it was a problem, you say something failed and now you have to replace it. But if you've tried those options and it's not the hardware, well, then it's probably the software because like I said, this error can be either a software or a hardware issue. Okay, so I've entered recovery manner. I'm going to select C, advanced option, repair options. Okay, now that I'm here, I'm going to go down to troubleshoot because we're going to have to reset this PC. Now you have two options. And we're going to do the remove everything option. The soft reset you can try, but a lot of times it just doesn't do it. Uh, I know it's sad to lose all your information, but we're trying to save it. We're trying to save a computer here, and sometimes it's the tough choices, that, the tough repairs that are the ones that get it done. Now, if you find you can't access your recovery manager, that could be because your Windows is too corrupt, or if you find the reset fails, it could also be because Windows is too corrupt. That's what's causing the error. All right, now that we're on the screen fully clean the drive. If that is the case, we have a video down below on how to reinstall Windows. Uh, so that would be your next option after this. So try resetting it, fully clean the drive. I'm not going to select it because this computer's fully working. But hit enter, reset the com computer. If that doesn't work, move on to the installation uh, option. But that is how I would troubleshoot this error on a Dell computer. If you have any questions, leave them down below. Thanks for watching our video. If you found it in any way helpful, please like and share. If you like do-it-yourself computer repair videos, then go ahead and subscribe. If you have any questions at all or you think of a great video to like to see from us, go ahead and leave your comments and messages down below and one of our certified technicians will get back to you. But anyway, from one egghead to another egghead, this is Liz signing out.